Hi everyone, it's Elle here to do a daily read, okay? Um, I hope that everyone's doing fine, doing well. Um, we're wrapping up August. Uh, happy birthday to my Virgos. Let's get, let's get it going. All right, the daily read. Today is August 24th. All right, let's see. Like energetically things are changing everybody is making changes you know um, seven is a cycle we've gone through seven months of the year when the eighth month is the so it's just you know this to start over it's the one month technically so everybody's making those changes you know everybody's looking real hard at what's going on what they've allowed what they haven't allowed um, how they want changes to to come into their life um, and some of you guys are initiating the change um, energetically just for all of all all of us out here all the people of the world it's, it's just a reflective time it's that hermit season it's that Virgo season where you're really doing that self reflection uh, getting in a place of understanding what part you played in whatever it is is going on with you um and they coming out of hermit mode and um being like an ace of wands type of energy and just really enacting all this this newness and change for you this change for the better um should always be changed for the better while wow. and then at the bottom of the deck the two of fire a lot of us are at crossroads like i said you know really um knowing that action needs to be taken taking action here but also you have two or more very real uh paths that you can take uh, and being at that crossroads and trying to figure it out in hermit mode let's see the hangman i felt the hangman energy messenger of fire justice nice and the five of earth um Some of you are feeling like karmically, um, a lot of you are trying to really get what's due to you karmically with justice. And you're allowing the universe to come in and right some wrongs for you. Uh, you're, you're at the hangman status where you're just kind of suspended. It, suspended in animation things are moving around you but you're not really taking part in a certain situation you're waiting for enlightenment you're waiting for that other shoe to drop that that piece of information you're waiting for justice to prevail some of you are waiting for actual legal matters here with the five of earth and the justice so that you can take action on something some of you it's it's the move away from um it could be an actual physical move it could be a job move it's it's kind of coming quickly for you um you know that you can stay where you are or you can go elsewhere and some of you may have even have a third option It's really just a day of putting it all together, waiting for a new perspective on things. Some of you, like some of you are waiting for a decision to be made, maybe legally. Some of you it's paperwork here, it's different legalities, um it, I mean, man, it could be anything right there. Um, some of you are waiting for payout. This could even be like child support, uh, claims, any type of claim with a big 
you know, company or whatever. But you're waiting to take action here. And you know that it needs to take it needs to take place. Some of you are waiting for the opportunity to move away from. Karmically, what you've done in the past, what you are expecting will come back to you. Um, justice is here. So do know that if you have maintained your integrity, your honesty through this situation, that's coming back to you. So this is the energy of today and more so self-reflecting, waiting, waiting for the opportunity. Um, knowing that it's coming, knowing that change is coming. I just, right, then the Empress, the bot under the two of fire. Waiting for that abundance. Waiting for the opportunity to be able to create the life that you want to create. Remember the Empress sits on the throne that she made for herself in the midst of wilderness, in the midst of nothing. Um, this is the person who creates the environment they want for themselves. Nothing is given to them. It's funny because they create the life that they want for themselves and then suitors or people come along and they then want to give to them. They then want to partner with them. They then want to um, share energy, share space with them after they've created such um, wonderfulness in their life. So I think a lot of you are really just trying to get to a place of um, abundance and uh, freedom. So if this reading resonated with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Go over to my website, book a reading. I now have a special um, $20 for 10 minutes. Uh, it's a video recorded reading, so it's not a phone reading. Um, it'll be up on the website in just a a bit um, go ahead and take advantage of that because I'm gonna take it down within maybe uh, three or four days okay um, thank you uh, know to stay in prayer I am praying for you pray for me as well take care guys